Ooh, so new spring box. Yay. <coughs> okay, and she is back. <laughs> Sorry, um, yeah, I was going through some things there. And I had to take some time away and get myself together. And then, um, yeah, I tried to do videos for Varsity Cup. But, yeah, I wasn't feeling it so much. But, like, um, yeah, I'm back now with uh, my selection. I was supposed to do this video actually a week ago with my own selection before they actually pick the team. So, um, yeah, let's see my picks against, like, um, who got picked for the spring box. Um, are let's see okay cool there we go okay so yeah i've been uh put this list together like about a month ago so <laughs> so yeah but i'm quite proud of it because it's really really close to who got picked for the squad so yeah so let's just get straight to the point yeah um uh, yeah my name is nono by the way and welcome back and um yeah thanks for tuning in i know i'm talking to myself right now so hopefully in the future somewhere, somehow, you know, I might get viewerships or sponsorships or whatever. Yeah, so I'm just at home, baby's asleep now. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, being a work at home, a work from home mom is tough. Anyway, so um, yeah, so the guys that I picked for my team, it's a mix of like, you know, guys overseas and guys here in SA. Uh, who all play for the spring box or played for the spring box or whatever so first off i chose corny with stays in like why not <laughs> and then um uh bismarck obvious choice because i have a crush on him and he's my dream guy <laughs> and then malcolm Marx. um and then obviously vincent koch was also one of my picks and then from the guys in SA, um, front row would be Ox and Che. And then Kurtz off. obviously, like, if you don't have Kurtz off in your team, what are you doing? And then obviously there's uh, Bongi and um, Franz Malherber and um, Thomas Dutoy. So it's mostly Stormers players. Um, yeah, my, I'm biased. <laughs> so it's okay. Whatever. And then um, after that, um, the other loose forwards is a loose forwards i don't even know anymore i'm so tired yeah i picked i think we've got the best um number fours and fives like overseas and in the country like you know yeah we hit the jackpot there so i, I picked uh it's a beth rg snayman lord and france uh franco mustard and then also based in sa i picked opa mohaje and uh willem alberts yeah, I really think uh, we are very blessed at lock. So, yeah, good for us. Anyway, um, yeah, so it's, it's a bit RG Stepan, Lourdes, Franco Mustard, Opa Mahaji, and um, Willem Albert. Like, I think, yeah, that's a really good choice, isn't it? Yeah, and then obviously at, um, at number six and seven, uh, our flankers, um, obviously I picked uh, Guaja overseas, like why not I have a soft spot for um, Lions players, so it is what it is, so deal with it. Um, Lapis Lavos Garni, Jasper Visa, Juan Ackerman who's been doing the things for Flossner, so yeah. Plus I think, um, yeah, I don't know why we let him go, but like he left with his dad, so it is what it is. And then obviously Daniel Dupl Dupria um overseas and i have a thing for the dupree brothers so you know anyway and then obviously uh our local ones um i've got colisi i got jack potter and um peter safety toy which i think is like a banging bunch so yeah so god I really hope that uh, Peter Steff doesn't need the Stormers and Bongi Murami doesn't need the Stormers because, like, I think we are, the Stormers are, like, literally holding on by a thread. So, yeah. It's good that at least we we got some players back from overseas, um, which I'll speak about in another video, but, like, I'm, like, really scared for that. Yeah, I'm really scared for the team. Anyway, and then, obviously, at um, at Scrum Off, I got uh, Franco Ochot, uh, Faf de Clerc, and then locally uh, we got Herschel. Uh, I still think he's got like um, some steam in him. 
and he's got that thing that people that most uh, number nines don't have um yeah so he's got the heart and then of course uh one be now since he's been such a good addition to the team yeah so um yeah one be now no worries <laughs> you're doing good for the cheaters that's all i can say so anyway at 10 obviously overseas we've got like you know the great andre pollard and then uh jan Kosen, who just came back from a really really good win in the um, yeah, championship and then uh, obviously locally we have um the obvious choice which who i know was gonna make it um money stain and then obviously Cohen bosch has been doing the things for the shots shame yeah shame good for you and then obviously at wings which is another position i feel like you know in sa we are so blessed we got like you know the best locks and we got the best wings and we got the best centers like our back line is bomb so yeah um at uh wings i got like my pimpy i got um obviously jesse creel cheslin the best player ever <laughs> i feel i don't care what anybody says but like he is the bomb diggity yeah yeah i'm that old <laughs> and then uh obviously locally we've got like lucano roscoe sibu sibunko si jeffy boy yeah I got friends who are from JP, so that's why. And uh, obviously, the boy that every guy in the country is crazy about, Wandile Simulani. I'm yet to see it, but you know what? I I trust I trust I trust my boys for, and um I try trust their vision. I trust their hearts. I trust everything. So like you know, to me, like he's the next big thing. I feel, I feel it. And then obviously there's uh, Clayton Glomagies. Yeah, I don't know, but like, you know, I, I don't feel like he got his time in the sun. Um, yeah. And then obviously um, we got uh, Damien Dialande. Obvious choice. If he doesn't make it, I would die of shock. And then obviously Juan De Young, who <laughs> recently came back to the stomach. Thank you. Thank you. And then I uh, got Lionel Mapu, shame, uh, he did the things in France and then came back. So, like, yeah. And of, of course, uh, Jan Selfantin. No worries. Just, yeah. He's also the bomb. He's also the bomb. Um, of course, Cornell Hendricks. He's been through a lot. He's, yeah. He deserves it. And, yeah, he deserves, um, yeah, I don't know, a good run. And then uh, Sergio Peterson. Um, yeah, I had to pick someone locally, but yeah, of course. And then obviously um, at uh, fifteen, I've got Manas Bosov. <laughs> I used to hate him every time the Stormers came to play the Sharks. Um, the Stormers came to play the Lions at Ellis Park, and he would always kick the balls. And yeah. Yeah, I, but I, I love him anyway. And then there's obviously Juan Combrink. And then there's David Creel locally. And we had Apelele Fasi, which I think he's also the next best thing. So look out for that boy. Yeah, I know I'm naming a lot of Sharks people, but like I'm refusing to support the Sharks. But <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. I just, you know, admire talent. And, you know, I see you. And then obviously there's um, Damien Willemsen, which I feel also like, yeah, you know, he deserves a chance, shame. He's, yeah, been through a lot. Okay, and that's my list of who I think deserves, should be picked. And um, the people who were picked. Okay, let's look at my book again. Um, we got like at Hooker is Joseph Dweba. I'm not sure about him. So I'm looking forward to you, like, you know, seeing what, what he's about. Malcolm Marx, my, my other man. Uh, Bongi Mulambi, please don't leave the Stormers. Please don't follow Sia. Stay with us. Stay with me. <laughs> and then there's um, Skaran Tombeni, um, yeah, which is like a good bunch. Yeah, no shame. Um, yeah, I guess uh, Bismarck was not available. 
anyway and then obviously at props we got thomas dutoy cuts off vincent koch my picks franz Mohober, oxen chair and trevor nagani and kone it was stays in oh lord sorry if i'm you know i'm not a good speaker that's why i'm in finance <laughs> <laughs> yeah shame um, yeah i felt bad after i made my first list and i realized i left out uh, trevor so he's got the best smile i love him i love him okay and then uh, the loose forwards we got daniel dupre i was right peter steph dutoy khaleesi um who is this oh my handwriting is so bad i have no idea and then we got kwaha which I'm so happy. Yay. Please don't disappoint me, please. I got so much faith in you. Um, um Jasper Vise, um Jean Luc Dupre. Um Marco van Staden and uh Dwayne Camillen. Yay. Close. <laughs> almost almost perfect. Perfect selection almost. And then obviously the locks we got uh Lord Etabeth, Franco Mustard. Marvin Ori, uh, R.G. Sneeman, Nico Janssen van Rensburg. So, all my picks and then some. Yeah. I guess the other guys will just play the, with Georgia, against Georgia and random countries. And then, um, you know, the top four that I, I picked, I, I, I'm hoping, uh, are going to play the Lions. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry guys, and then um got like at number nine obviously we have Faf my pick, Herschel Yankees my pick, Sanele Nohamba, we'll see we'll see about you, don't disappoint, and Krobus Reiner. Yeah, love it, and then obviously at ten. Yeah, Elton Yankees. Mm hmm. Pollard obvious choice, um Stain. Um, Franz Stein, no, not Franz Stein, Monet Stein. Sorry, I mix up my stains all the time. Yeah, Monet Stein, and yeah, pretty good picks. I wish they got uh, at least um, Kerwin in there, but like um, the coach did say, like if anything happens, he's so, he'll be called up. So let's just hope it's not just this. Anyway, at centers we got Franz Stein. Yeah. Can't he just rest and play for the cheetahs because we get it he's got the boot and everything my he's great but he's had his time he's had his time just like Monet Stain, they've had their time give give us a chance give other kids a chance anyway and then obviously there's uh lucano and um Dielande and wandile Semelani and jesse creel i was right Kind of, and then we got Cheslin, we got Mabimpi, we got Subu Mkosi, and then we have another one I don't know. Is it Yao Pengle? And then there's um, Roscoe Speck, which I'm very, very happy for him. Shame. Um, I thought maybe he's going to go to the Sevens and play in the Olympics, but like, um, I guess he got called up the Springboks. But like, middle play against the Lions, I guess he picked what he picked for him though but like he's got that gas that cheslin has i think if they put start him and cheslin yeah they could do some things and then obviously i'm so proud apelele made it yay good for you i'm so happy for him and then uh vili leroux is another one i think uh it's time Just rest 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 i'd rather have france at fullback and then we got like Damon Willemse, shame. Um, yeah, I'm pretty bummed that Sergio Peterson didn't make it. I'm pretty bummed that uh, Dylan Leeds, like, you know, have you seen him? Oh, like, is it, he, he plays for La Rochelle, right? Or something. But like, he's doing the things. He's like, yeah. Yeah, shame. Yeah, what a bummer. What a bummer there. And then obviously, Serpentine, like, you know, what a waste. Like, he just came off like a big win. Um, overseas in europe and um yeah i think he would have been a good addition to the team but yeah and then obviously i'm a bit bummed also that uh who else didn't make it uh bismarck didn't make it Labby didn't make it um 
when I come and didn't make it, obviously, Billy Brits, obviously, Fanta Wokhat, like, I'm shocked that he didn't make it. Usually, he does make it somehow. He's, he's yeah, he's like Monet Stay and they always just pick him. Yeah, I really thought he was going to make it. Yeah, man. And, um, it's Kumbuzi Noche, like, he's got that thing as well, but, like, I don't know why he didn't make it. But, like, that's for my, for my choices. And then obviously they said like uh, with Conal Hendricks, um, he's um, he's got some illness. I think lungs. I don't know. He's got yeah medical reasons. That's why he wasn't picked for the Springboks. But like you know, hopefully he'll get better and then uh, be you know first choice up if uh, none of these guys do the things. And then obviously, Karen Bosch. It it really hurts my feelings that he didn't make it. It really does. Yeah. But I'm like, I'm pretty happy with the squad so far. I'm not upset. But, you know, it's pretty good. And I hope that we can hold up against the British and Irish Lions. Which, yeah, I'm nervous, but I'm hopeful. So, <laughs> let's just hope. Yeah, because even on my Twitter, some guy, um, they even wrote um the screenshots here on my phone about like you know players who didn't make it that should have made it but um yeah too bad so sad and uh good luck to the box and i'll be here supporting you <laughs> and i i think it's a, there's a conspiracy they're playing us against like random countries and our proper ones because like you know covid or whatever but like it's been running running rife in france and they get to play whatever but like they can't go there and then they keep taking our players like even with elton yankees he went to europe to go play for one of the teams on loan but they don't want to bring the spring box there for, for for that i wish that we beat them and not by a small like whitewash that's what i feel but anyway thanks for joining me and um yeah I look forward to more videos. <laughs> Ciao for Mrs. D's desk. Bye.